powerful. We are strong. You are indeed the voice of America. And we're here today to tell George Bush and the corporate fat cats that we're not going to let them take away our retirement, our Social Security, and we have the support, the support of the American people, and we have the power. You know, for 25 years, I have worked with AFSCME retirees, and we could always count on AFSCME retirees, not only here in Illinois, but around the country. And I want to give a very big thanks to Jerry McEntee, whose vision really was the spearhead of the activities in favor of elderly, not just AFSCME retirees, but for older Americans everywhere. I especially want to thank Jerry for the work that he did in 2005. Uh, he was really the leader of the effort to stop the Bush administration from privatizing Social Security. Remember that battle? We won it. And Jerry was um, able to form Americans United, which was a coalition across the, uh, the country that fought relentlessly. The other thing that I really appreciate about Jerry and about AFSCME is that when members of Congress stand up for working families, then AFSCME is going to be there with us. So I look forward to standing shoulder to shoulder with my brothers and sisters and AFSCME and carrying on the battle and following Jerry McEntee. President McEntee was really a strong uh, person for our retirees. He, when he came on, we grew and grew large and we have grown to 250,000 members. On behalf of all the Ask Me retirees, we want to thank you, Jerry McEntee, for all your hard work and, and resources to help us grow. Ten years ago, Jerry McEntee was one of the leaders that helped to form the Alliance for Retired Americans. It was a small group, and they put their resources and their ideas behind it and brought it to reality. Today, we look to AFSCME and Jerry McEntee to provide us with the leadership and the information to move ahead. When the Alliance needs help, they turn to AFSCME. It's one of the unions that does a great job for us. Thanks to President McEntee, the retirees have gained a lot of experience in the political arena. In 2008, President McEntee sent many retirees to Iowa for the presidential caucuses. We did our phone banks, we did our house to house, we did whatever we had to do to make sure that AFSCME was represented at the caucuses. It was something that myself and most of the retirees never done before, and we'd like to thank President McEntee for the truly, truly good experience. Over the years, we at the National Committee to Preserve Social Security and Medicare have been so pleased to work with Jerry McEntee and his staff to build the Seniors Council of the Democratic National Committee. We've worked together to support candidates for Congress who will protect the program seniors depend on. AFSCME Retirees was one of the first union groups to join the Leadership Council of Aging Organizations. When the National Committee chairs the coalition, we depend on AFSCME to play an active role in LCAO committees, lobby meetings, and congressional forums. I really want to thank Jerry for making retirement security a top priority on AFSCME's agenda. Thank you, Jerry. I would like to thank uh, Mr. Mike and T for his dream about the retirees and organizing us so that we became an additional viable organizational group. In Ohio, we now have approximately 20,000 members. Uh, and they are spread out around the state of Ohio in 20 sub-chapters. I would also like to thank President McEntee for his help and support in helping the retirees to get a COLA, which keeps our pensions current with the cost of living. We are very happy to be a part of the AFSCME International Mean Green Machine. Since becoming president in 1981, Jerry McEntee knew the value of growing our retirees' numbers within our union. He understood that retirees could be some of our strongest activists 
working in political campaigns and legislative campaigns and organizing campaigns across this country. Under his leadership, our retirees' numbers have grown from 15,000 to 250,000. Without his vision, without his commitment, without the resources that he has committed to growing our retiree numbers, this would never have occurred. His vision has helped us become one of the strongest unions with one of the most strongest retiree organizations in the American labor movement. So on behalf of our 1.6 million active and retiree members within AFSME, we want to say thank you to Jerry McEntee. Thank you for his vision. Thank you for his leadership. Thank you for leading one of the strongest and best unions in the American labor movement. Social Security keeps people out of poverty. Social Security lets people retire with peace of mind. And when we defeat his plan, Bush will be relegated to the sidelines of America as a lame duck president. God bless you and God bless Social Security. Thank you. Thank you.